tail, and we were running free. I just chased it around the hillside, and then I, I wait for him down in the mud. <laughs> That's a fast rabbit. Hmm, fast, but dumb. Don't know when to keep its head down. So there it is, rustling around the leaves, see? I think uh, under cover of the brush, them, them hawks ain't gonna see them. They're tickling the grass. The bam! The bull's straight there. Hmm. Mm. Five big ones, little. Ruth was my friend. What'd you say? You gonna pay for your sinning? She told me she wasn't the first. First? She can't tell you nothing. Who been talking them lies, the preacher? Angels. Get her, boy. Rabbit's running. We see it! Go ahead now, it ain't nowhere safe. Hawk is gonna find you. Smiling, why'd you wait so long? It's just my only crutch, and it's over my shoulder. Well, you're talking so fast that the days turned out slower. Keep on the path I sent you on. Visionaries aren't brown no more. They left their markings in the coconut forest and scraped on the shore for the days that had rolled on. Keep on the path I sent you on. I reckon you run up front side of the nail. 
Yeah, I think so. I tried calling for help, but... Yeah, that wouldn't work when you need it to now, would it? <laughs> no, I guess not. Well, let me have a little look take see what you got here. Thank you. Well, yep, that's on there. Yeah, I did my best. Y'all them folk what moved up Caplewood. Yeah, we are. Oh, it's a good old house. Good old house. Yeah, it is. Far cry from the city, huh? Yeah, it's beautiful. Well, along with our pristine roads, people say we're famous for our views. Thank you so much. What do I owe you? No, ma'am. No, I could not have done this myself. Nah. You could have. And you would have, too. Besides, I'd hate to have to haul you in for bribing an officer of the law before y'all even get settled. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you again. Ma'am, excuse me, what is that right there? It's a birthmark. Good day. Oh, ma'am? One thing I might should say, being as y'all ain't from around here, not all places is fit for visiting. What do you mean? Well, there's some strange folk around here. They made their life on their own, God bless them, and they not be disturbed as all. Hey, babe. Hi, sweetie. Where you been? Oh, don't ask. <laughs> a little bit of a disaster. Hi. Oh, I missed you, too. I blew a tire, though. That's why I'm late. I'm sorry. Uh, please tell me you didn't change it. <laughs> no. I actually tried to, but then a local came by and helped me. Oh, wow. It's a little creepy, but he still did it. Yeah, and I almost cut off my finger. You almost cut off your finger? Yeah, perils of housework. Oh, look at you, tough guy. Yeah, watch out. Your nails getting dirty. Right? I like it. So, uh, what are you making tonight? <laughs> uh, I'm going to make something called a Huntington in a party. Perfect. Job well done today. Yeah, thanks. We were like 20% done. <laughs> I think we're finally where we need to be. This really feels like home. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you for coming. This is my husband. How you doing, Dave? Yeah, pleasure. Oh, thank you. I know. I'm huge. <laughs> Come here, come in. I want to show you. Oh, my God. I'm so jealous. Oh, don't be, please. It's yours. Anytime oh. you just say the word. Well, it's actually the uh, banks, but of course, let facts get in the way. <laughs> and this one, too, of course, if he plays his cards right. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, this is where we're going to do it. Uh, do. It. Yeah, that's where the magic happens. Yeah, we've already got the midwife, and of course my favorite doctor is going to be on call. Oh, so you're giving birth here? Yeah, that's yeah. the plan. I mean, fingers crossed. <laughs> you guys, this is really wonderful. I'm, I'm really excited for you guys. Thank you. <laughs> I'm pretty happy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you the rest of the house. Come here. Come on. Excuse us. Thank you. You, sir, thirsty? Absolutely. Oh, yes, we really can. Yes. <laughs> my God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well done. So, any <laughs> tips for a uh, new local? Oh, uh, uh, soda's fine. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry, tips for a local? Yeah, Sarah says you grew up around here. Oh, uh, more like 50 miles south, closer to the city. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, 
Different world out here. Yeah, it's interesting. <laughs> I hear you play football. Used to. Had a ride back at state until I threw my back out. Oh, sorry to hear about that. And now? Personal trainer. Play a little touch on the weekends if I'm feeling frisky. Oh, nice. Yeah, back trauma's no joke. And the list gets scarier with football players. Count your blessings. Cheers. Cheers. So how long has it been since you've seen them, then? Every other month or so, maybe. I don't know. That's great. That means this medicine's actually working, then. Yeah, I mean, I'm not... I'm not gonna embarrass you or anything if that's what you're worried about. So. No, that is not... You have never embarrassed me. That's no, not what I meant at all. I know. You know, I've had my own issues with seeing things. I know, I know. It's just... It, it's just weird. Like, you live with these people since you're a kid, and then a doctor comes along and tells you that they're not real, that it doesn't exist, and to take this medicine, and it's gonna make you all better, and... and then everyone's gone. I'm not gone. I'm not going anywhere. Matt's not going anywhere. Dave seems pretty real. I mean, that guy, <laughs> wow, he seems really real. I think I really like him. Good. I'm really looking forward to getting to know him. No fucking way. Nice date! This is sick. Hey! What the hell, stranger? Uh, you know, I figured you invited us, and what kind of uncle would I be if I didn't show up? <laughs> Hi! I did invite you. That was about five months ago, though, and you were supposed to RSVP. Well, if RSVP means show up with dirty laundry, then we <laughs> did just that. That's exactly what it means. Yeah, hey, I want you to meet the pearl of my life. This is Sky. Sky, this is my sister. Hey, Sarah. God, you're gorgeous. Oh, Steve, thank, you, thank you for letting us crash. So cool with you. You are so welcome. And this right here is Sabrina La Teenage Bruja, all grown up. Yeah, it looks like you've come a long way. Hi, thank you very much. Yeah, that is ours right there. We love her, don't we? Mm -hmm. Own it, huh? Is that Dr. Matt over there? Hey, we're gonna go get cleaned up real quick, all right? Look for lunch, bud. Hey. You don't have to worry about embarrassing me now. Some brothers here. <laughs> Hi. Hey, white wine? Oh, no, this is apple juice. I just like to pretend. Oh, Rod, what kind of clothes? Uh, casual workwear. Uh, that's what I call it anyway. It's like light wools and stitched patterns. Cool. Like, um,. This? Yeah, yeah, like like this, actually. Nice. <laughs> I like it. So you really think I'd enjoy burning it? Bro, would, would you enjoy the true freedom of the mind? Yeah, it's a good little clinic. Only about 20 intakes a day. Wow, that'll be a change. Yeah, I can't wait. You know, city life's good for your 20s, but after that, it gets a little crazy. That's <laughs> perfect for you guys. Yeah, we've been just, like, traveling around for the last six months. Yeah, Eric said, like, Oregon, Arizona. Oh, Arizona was amazing. The Red Rocks are so groovy. Uh, we're trying to get down to the Gulf Coast for summer. Those cute towns. Those cute towns. Yes, those cute towns. I want to see them. So cute. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like your charm. Oh, right on, yeah. I got this at this little flea market in Tahoma, you know, and it kind of, like, I don't know, it kind of drew us here, you know? Have you been out to the woods yet? Oh, no, we haven't had time yet. Mm. There's a doctor not want to pitch a tent. <laughs> Do you guys need anything? No, I'm good, baby. All right. Good, yeah. thank you. How great is she? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, she seems really sweet. She is. When are you planning on getting home? We're home. This is it. Oh, come on, don't... <laughs> Don't give me that look, all right? I'm not trying to move into your big house with too many rooms. Okay. Our home is the slab that we rolled in on. That's our home now. You are going to live in the van? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, besides, we can't really, um... We can't really go back to the apartment. You know, we haven't paid rent since, like, November. But, no, but it, the walls were getting small, and it was, it was like... It was really, like... Jesus, Eric, just I don't know, the energy down. wasn't there, you know? Okay, have you thought about getting a job? Yeah. Yeah, I mean... I don't know, you know, it's like, life is about living, you know, living. Yeah, living takes money, Eric, <sighs> food, gas. We'll be all right, I always am, you know that. <clears throat> Look at you, grill master. Yeah, it's actually all local. Yeah, cool. Yeah, would you like one? Um, uh, I kind uh, of am, uh, 
actually a bed. Yeah, I don't know. I wish I would have known. No, dude, uh, it's cold. No, hold tight. Um, I think I might have something for you. Don't, like, go out of your way no. for me or anything. Not a problem. And I hope that that's enough to carry you for a little bit. Oh, babe, it's more than enough. Thank you. Babe, do you have any of that, uh, pasta left? Hey, give me a beer or something. Uh, I'm good. All right. What am I supposed to do? This is such a quaint little spread. Who would have thought the big city elitism would travel so cool to the country, huh? Yeah, well, that big city elitism is financing your dirtbag life. Hey, so, uh, Matt, I see you still got, uh, Dad's old Jeep? Yeah, it's a workhorse. Hauled some brush off the road with it last weekend. I always thought the doctors all drove Audis, you know? Well, this doctor doesn't. But it's just because he's made some sacrifices for me and our family. And the baby is the only thing that matters to us. Probably the rest of it will come in time, Audis included. Okay? Does anybody mind if I freshen up? It's been, like, a lot longer than I'd care to admit. Yeah, 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 come here. Here you go. Yeah, yeah, I think I just fell asleep. Hey, 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 hey. I, I heard her scream. I went to help. I didn't think she was going to be half naked. Well, I didn't seem to mind either. So. Well, I was checking out our guest. What's your deal? I don't know. I'm sorry. I've been having these really weird thoughts lately about us and the move and the baby and... It's okay. We're fine. Sit down. I know the baby's perfect. Every test we've done, every sonogram, they've all said the same thing. Yeah, I know. I just... Yeah, what did you just want? I don't know how to explain it. When I was on the road yesterday, the trees and the clouds, and there were these wild flowers everywhere. And things just... They move so quickly, you know? Time just passes, and life is... It's so precious, it's so fragile, and... Like it's gone so quickly. Hey, look at me. We're the lucky ones. Other people, they they go through life and they don't have what we have. We're strong because we have each other. I know. I just want her to live a long, happy life. Yeah, well, she will. I promise. <laughs> I will personally make sure of it. <laughs> I just love her so much, you know? Yeah. I would do anything for her. Everything's gonna be fine. I know. It was a man. What kind of man? Dark hair. Beard, long beard. Eyes like fire. Eyes like fire? Did he say anything to you? No. Did you say anything to him? Uh, no, I don't think so. I don't really remember. 
I don't want to talk about it anymore. Okay, copy that. I'm gonna give you a pass this time, but this is, this is some good stuff. It's not for a walk. All right, there it goes. You got it. You got it. Good job. Ooh, that looks like man. a. <laughs> Just a little something. Oh, oh, oh these. Oh. Yeah. Throw, yeah, right? Come on. And the game is over. <sighs> okay, you do it, you do it. I'll watch it. Eric. You got ready? The ready? Yeah. Oh, oh, shoot, sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's good. Wow. My yeah. bad. Uh, <laughs> just one more time to kiss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys live on a cemetery. That's awesome. It's not a cemetery. It's a plot. Oh, my oh. God, Matt. She was so young. All right, guys, come on. I know this is a bummer, right? But, hey, we're alive, so we should live. We're here to have fun. I mean, we showed up. She's not going anywhere. You can come back and visit her later. Come on. First one to the beer wins. <laughs> So we check into the haunted hotel in Portland, right? And I guess like the ninth floor is the most haunted. And so what floor do they put us on? <laughs> but the ninth. <laughs> do you really believe that crap? Dude, all along the coast we stopped at these plantations to hunt. To hunt. For ghosts. Oh yeah, right. Oh seriously, bro. Oh no, seriously. No, let me show you. Boom. Oh, what's that? Ah, EVP recorder. It stands for Electronic Voice Phenomena. And you use that to... To hunt ghosts. Oh. I'd laugh if you want, but I'm telling you, have you guys ever been in these slave quarters before? It's crazy. Okay, they got these, like, four-foot ceilings, and they got these, like, these chains hanging off the walls, and I'm telling you, you can feel it. I mean, these spirits, they want to be heard. You hear them? Yeah. Take a listen. Eric. Hey. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Uh, what the hell is this? You don't hear it? Well, no, I, I hear it. I just don't hear it. You're not listening, bro. Yeah, bro. Well, I'm done listening for today. Dude, if you don't believe me, ask Sarah. Ask her what? Ask her if she believes in ghosts. Stop it, Eric. What? I mean, you've never told me. Tell me what? Nothing. When we were kids. Stop. Oh, when you were kids, what? When we were kids, there were ghosts in our house. Who were there? It was two days before our sixth birthday, and they came for us. <laughs> They came for you? Yeah. 
you know what saved us? Butterflies. Look what happened. Happened, all right? There's no reason to deny it. Don't be a dick. I'm not trying to be a dick. I'm sorry, I didn't... Sarah, come on! You know, it's, it's, it's hard to believe that she's related to you. Why is that? Well, for one thing, she's loving, she's kind, she's considerate. Pretty much all the things that you're not. Wow. I guess everybody has to have their opposite, right? Probably why she chose you. some good ghost fodder up in these mountains. Yeah? What do you mean? There was a serial killer back in the 70s. Who? The newspapers called him Cannibal Kane, said he mutilated his victims, then ate them. Some weird satanic something or other. They caught him, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Creepy to know that there's people like that in jail getting old like the rest of us. Well, not anymore. But he got out? No, 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 no. Uh, he died. The prison burnt down back in the 80s. It was like it was a big story around here. Something like 100 people were trapped inside and died in their we cell. We need to check that out. Yeah, we do. What? Yeah, it's a perfect night, full moon. Oh, excuse me? Wait, you want to take us to a burnt out prison in the middle of nowhere? Yeah. At night, because there's a full moon. Somehow a full moon makes that a good idea? If you want to go now, there's still daylight left, but, um... Well, the only thing is, is that the ghosts don't come out until night. Uh, that's right. That's in your, uh, your your ghost hunting manual, right? I, I have <laughs> always wanted to see that place. I'm just saying. I'm sorry, what? I, I say we go. It'll be fun. Come on, Bree. In high school, all the kids used to go up there. It was like a dare, kind of like make out in the in the prison kind of thing, you know? Ah. <laughs> make some more recordings. Add it to the box. Yeah. Yes. I don't want to do this. It'll be fun. Where's fun, Bree? Let's go. How about you, Matt? You game? Come on. Come on, if there's no ghosts, it's no big deal, right? You serious? Okay, uh, I'm in. <laughs> yeah! Yes! Wow. Baby, it's, it's, it's cool, it's fun, it's no big deal. Okay? <laughs> Little adventure. Babe. Hey, where's that old crappy sweater I love? Why are you doing this? Man, it's gonna get cold. That's not what I mean. No, what the hell was he talking about with the butterflies? It was with Eric. I mean, I don't know. They probably just nested under the house and then got out, got into our room somehow. Look, he tells his bullshit stories and he travels around the world pissing away our money and, and I'm, I'm over it. Now this shit? Ghosts? Butterflies? Really? No, oh, you never shared that with me. I want your brother out of here. Can you keep your voice down, please? I'm sorry about the check. I should have said something. Yeah, well, it's, it's, it's bigger than the check. It's everything. Not responding to your emails, uh, blowing off your phone calls, and now the random showing up to crash whenever he wants, telling more bullshit stories that are obviously bothering you. Well, how is this helping? I want to see what he sees. And call bullshit on it. Finally chip away at this, this myth he's built his entire life around. Okay, well, he's not your responsibility. Yeah, well, you are. And you're going to be the mother of a child. Even though you were born two minutes before he was, you've been playing big sister for way too long. He's got to grow up. It starts today. That's better.
back in now. You know, someday you're gonna realize that this isn't a mistake. What isn't a mistake? Who we are. The things we've seen, the things that we've been shown. Terry, you and I have a gift. Oh, I do have a gift. And you've managed to convince him to take this stupid hike. And if anything happens to him, I will kill you with my bare hands. Yes, ma'am. See you later. Would anybody build a prison out here? Why not? Probably safer out here than Alcatraz. How the hell would you find your way out of this place? Say we divide and conquer. Great. Wow. Place. It's insane. It just keeps going. <laughs> hey. Look what I got. Look at you prepared. Go get this cannibal motherfucker. <laughs> you ready? You know what?
gonna be good. No, no, no. Would oh, you smoke too much? Uh, yeah, I think so. <laughs> hey, we don't have much time left to go down here. Come on. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to. Hey, let's grab it. This is what we came for, right here. Yeah, I'm just. I'm not feeling it, baby. Come on, hey, I'm not gonna let anything happen to you. I'm gonna take real good care of you. <laughs> Clear. Ooh. Okay. Oh, this is the old mess hall. Yeah. Okay. I'm done. We can go. We've seen this, right? What? Hey, look, it's just an old building. There's nothing to be scared of. Okay? No, I know. Okay. I know. All right. I just want to go. I'm just done. Okay. All right. Prisoners died. This is fucking it. You here with us, Kate? Kate, are you here? No way. What the hell is that? these people up in the mountains. They developed their own kind of religion. Some sort of demonology based on voodoo and Christianity and oral traditions all combined. Siri Hana. And maybe Siri Hana is their savior. More like their devil. Baby, look at this. The lost return, awakening the dead, and the end begins, drawing the devil from out of the cycle. Hello? Jesus! I don't like this air. Calm down. This isn't like anything we've ever experienced. Please continue. Hey, just it's go. it's just our friends trying no, to I don't play fucking care. This place gives me the creeps, all right? Take some photos to prove we were here, and let's go. Okay. Okay. I love you.
Stop bleeding. I don't understand. We, we just gotta get out of here. Sarah should be waiting for us. Look, I still think it's safer in here than out there. Are you fucking kidding me? Did you not see what just happened? Matt, I lived it. The only difference between you and me is that I don't want to run from it. The difference is you're fucking insane, okay? The side effect is you don't want to run. Stop you know fighting. Am I all alone here? Does anyone else see how fucking insane this is? I'm ready to go home. Well, there's something down there. Guys, it wants to be heard. It wants us to hear it. Don't you get that? You want to stick around with a couple of flashlights, find out what it is? Hey, Eric, please. Okay, yeah, you know, we're going. I'm not going. Sure. Baby, whatever's down there, it's not going anywhere. Hey, come on. Fine, fine. We're coming back. Thank you so much. I need to get to a hospital immediately. I did not think that anybody was going to stop. You, Sam? Yeah, um... I was just saying thank you. Thank you so much. Nice night for a walk. How the hell did we get back here? I, like, I, I don't know, all right? Will you just, please? Everybody, please, just chill out, okay? So what's going on? Maybe there's something in that book. What are you talking about? What book? <clears throat> what, do you guys know something that I don't? What book? Right here, thank you. She writes the offered. Upon seducing the soul of the newborn, the vessel will deliver the chosen. We, uh, we have to get the hell out of here. How? No, there, there, there has to be another path. We have to try again. Jeez, dude, what kind of evil is in this place? Oh, can somebody tell me what is happening? Is this, is this real? Is this real? No, no, we will find a way out of here. Eric, what are you doing? Eric! This is where we're supposed to be. Right here, this is the strongest signal I've ever gotten. Now, we were brought here for a reason. I don't know about you guys, but I'm gonna go find out what that reason is. If you go down there, I'm not following you. Eric! Sky, let him go. My brother said that. A pretty young woman's expecting to just settle in these parts. Um, my husband and our friends went over to look for that prison. That burnt down? 
Yeah. Anyway, I was supposed to go get them, so can we pick them up on the way? There's one good thing that came out of that fire, at least. They killed that devil preacher, Cain. Killed him good. We heard about him. You most have. Most in these parts had had someone they loved pulled off into the next world by his bush axe. That man had no governor. Pure evil he was. How did they catch him? Martin Obey. The captain got him. The captain? Well, he ain't been that for a while, but we still call him. They let me ride along for old time's sake. Feels like home in the squad car. He, he brought a lot of these parts. He's the one that kept this place from falling to the sodomites. What is that? People up here believe different. Traditions all just passed down generations. These aren't the same ones that we took to get up here. More than one road in the hills. Mm. Oh. <sighs> mm. What you calling that? Oh. <laughs> Your body speaking at you? Yeah, I need you to pull over. Well, we're gonna be at it in a few minutes. No, I'm gonna be sick. I need you to pull over now. Please. Okay, we have to find another way out of here. Oh, yeah, how? It's pitch black out there. You have a better idea? Yeah, we call for help. No one can get any reception. No, we can't. We just have to, we just have to keep trying. Fuck. Yeah, you because know, Sarah's, Sarah's out there, you know, and she's, and she's, and she's waiting for us. Hey, 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 calm down, calm down. Guys! Chewing on those, like, tic tacs. Hey. What is that? Dorothy. How many of these have you taken? How long have you been on this? Since I was eight years old, all right? I've been a fucking schizophrenic since I was eight years old. Sarah? Hey, we're lost. Can you help us? Oh, shit. What's up, what's up? There's people out there. What? Who are they? We don't want to find out. What are we going to do? OK, I yeah, think, 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 think. OK, look, look, look. We hide in there, and we wait them out. Are you fucking insane? Am I fucking insane? What, do you want to hang around and say hi? That's gotta be another way. Maybe, maybe we can sidestep them. What if we can't leave this place? What if every path leads us back here? And we are gonna leave this place. Help me. Let them bring it the fuck on. All right, you take them and hide the girls. I'm gonna try to divert them and send for help. Let's go, let's go, let's go, come on.
We gotta find Eric. What? He doesn't know there are people out there. Look, if he wants to go on his little field trip, that's fine, but this bus is not taking any detours. He's gonna leave him? Hey! Hey, look, we're gonna get out of this hellhole one way or another, but I'm not searching for him. Come on. Eric? What are you doing? Just give me a minute, Bree. Oh, hell no. Come on. Murder, rape. Stabbed to death. Buried alive. Jesus Christ. It's almost like someone wanted us to find this. Bree! What spirits are trapped in here? Come on, I know you can hear me. 
Just speak to me, okay? Come on, God damn it! Talk to us! Those people are coming. This place is some sort of sanctuary. We don't belong here. your ass if you're wrong, boy. Say so? Speak to yourself. Got the mark. My prayers have been answered. What she do? She's just a kid. Lord have mercy. That's what she's gonna do. Tell sister to prepare the vessel. The little moon could prove fertile tonight. need love. You can get now. This is my work. Captain's gonna put on a show tonight. Oh! 
Your choice will be right. like you're in a trance or something. No, I was watching... There's some seriously weird fucking shit going on right now. Where's Matt? I don't know. You don't know? No, I don't... What's this? I mean... Mutilated skin... skin alive. Where did you get this? Dave had it. He... Eric, he's dead. He's what? Dusty Capleton and Anna Harris found them. Anna Harris? That's the name of the grave in the woods. December 5th, 1979. She died on the day we were born. What the fuck is going on? Eric, I'm scared. Shh. Eric, I have a family. I have a baby. I need to get the fuck out of here. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, okay, we will get out of here. Okay? You just could not keep your mouth shut, could you? I was just gonna give you life and leave it at that, but now, now I gotta take that from you. Those kids never judge me. Why, Jew? I done evil. I done it for you. 
but I never killed those kids. Free job! You should have just done your job, boy! No matter when nobody's there. We make the law around here. The Oxicon Luminate Ray, a fern, Maxon. Perpetuum. No, stop, let me go. Oh, no. Please don't hurt my baby. Shh, shh, shh. Sweet angel, we're not going to hurt your baby. No, Annie, no, please, no. Oh. Calm yourself. Get this child out of you. Now give it everything you got. Push now. Don't you go white eye on me. Here she comes. She isn't crying. Cause she ain't breathing. No. 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 Give me my baby. Give me my baby. Give me my baby. Do you want your child to live? Hey, look at me. We're the lucky ones. I just want her to live a long, happy life. Yeah, well, she will. I promise. Everything's gonna be fine. I know. Yes. 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 